Hello guys, one word, data tables. Data tables have been like the number one topic since the beginning of the web with various solutions for them. So table with some filters and sorting and stuff like that. And today I want to show you another example, another new package for that called live wire tables. It is created by Raymond Riedick. I hope I pronounced it correctly from the Netherlands. And I will quickly demonstrate to you how it works and also mention the filament alternative. So if we take a look at the demo of those live wire tables, I haven't even installed it locally, but I will just show it to you how it works. So for example, you can search in the column. That's official demo, by the way, it's public. It's in the readme of the package. So you can play around with it yourself. So you can search, you can cancel the search, you can enable or disable bulk operations, you can refresh, then choose columns like category or something like that, then add filters, then add custom actions, delete something and choose the pagination options. And of course the pagination works. So pretty simple data table visually, but pretty powerful with a lot of filters, including those per column like this one. And you can use that inside of your Livewire project. Here's the official documentation page for the installation. You require the package, then you need to configure your tailwind and publish the views. And the example Laravel code looks like this. So you define the columns with like image column and select column, and it may be sortable, searchable, format, clickable, and stuff like that. Then there's filters then there's actions. And then the documentation, of course, mentions all of those in detail in each section. So it looks like a great package with quite a lot of GitHub stars. I often measure the popularity of the project by this number. 100 is already kind of, I would say, minimum amount for that to be considerable as used by someone. But also while looking at the example, it kind of reminded me of filament and its structure and its syntax. Since we've been working quite a lot with filament in recent months with Laravel Daily Team, I couldn't help but compare those things. And that's why I want to talk about alternative. Maybe not everyone knows that you can use filament tables as a standalone package without using the filament admin panel. So if we take a look at the docs of filament, there's form builder and table builder and both can be used outside of Panel Builder. So the installation of Table Builder says that Builder package is pre-installed with the Panel Builder, but if you don't have the Panel Builder, you have the requirements and you can install separately filament tables, just tables without filament itself. Of course, you need to configure then CSS, Tailwind, Styles, and a few more things like Vite config and compile the assets and the layout but filament tables is actually another alternative for data tables. You can consider that live wire tables as well. And we try to implement exactly that in one of our latest projects, we launched filamentexamples.com. So we try to implement table in public outside of the panel. So here's how it looks. Simple page, it's not a filament panel, so you don't see a menu here. There's no login, there's no session, it's not authenticated user but there's a table, which actually looks like filament table because it has the same style. And also you can search, you can filter. So for example, you can filter by price from 1000, then it filters the prices, then there's pagination. So typical filament table, but outside filament. So yeah, to recap in this video, I wanted to show you two alternatives for live wire data tables, and there are more alternatives. If you Google Laravel data tables or live wire data tables, it seems like many developers have almost like on their bucket list to create data tables package. Most of them are then abandoned after a while, but I'm pretty sure that filament will stay for quite a long time on the market, at least judging from the amount of questions I get bombarded about filament. And that's why I created a separate channel filament daily. If you haven't subscribed yet, you can go and subscribe. But also, if you're not a fan of filament, live wire tables is also a great alternative. What do you think and what data tables you use these days in your project? Not necessarily with live wire or filament. Oh, and by the way, side note, I remembered now totally randomly that we recently released an article, this one, Vue.js data tables. So if you're not a Tallstack user, but you prefer Vue.js with inertia, there's a package data tables net, the old classical data tables net for Vue 3. So I will link that tutorial as well in the description below. So yeah, what data table system or package do you use these days? Let's discuss in the comments and see you guys in other videos.